and then I can go take a nap. Hirune. 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 Cool. Let's do some snacks. And I have a, some interesting items, including one. What? <laughs> What's going on? What's going on? That's not it. Including, I'm making so much noise. I'm sorry. Including one thing that I, I I picked up yesterday, which I was super. I'm super excited about. So I have three things. One is a bunch of strawberry chocolates. <laughs> this is. The, You've seen these before. I, I I get these a lot because they always have weird flavors. This one is um, I, Ichigo Ipai, which means a lot of strawberry. <laughs> ipai means uh, full or many or a lot. So it's Ipai Ichigo. <laughs> ichigo ga Ipai. So a lot of strawberry. So it's strawberry shortcake. Ichigo shorto cakey. Ichigo uh, brownie and Ichigo uh, mousse. So strawberry shortcake, strawberry brownie, and strawberry mousse. Um, and then I also got Manai's favorite flavor, <laughs> which is Kon Pataji. So this is so these uh, chocolates are very popular here in Japan. Um, Kon Pataji, um, uh, Daijiu, Kon Pataji. Oh, no, 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 Ta Tajiu, Tajiu. Oh, no. Anyways, these chocolates are very popular. I don't know if I'm saying the name right. Um, they make all sorts of different flavors. They're kind of like they're sort of like a, um, what are they like? I'm trying to think of an American candy bar that it's like. Not Nestle Crunch. Sort of like a Nestle, kind of like a crunch, mm, like a thicker Nestle Crunch. I don't know. Anyways, they do different flavors. So they have corn potaji. And then here's my favorite, which I can't wait to try. <laughs> Wasabi Doritos. What? <laughs> <laughs> wasabi doritos holy crap i'm so excited can't wait to try these um i love doritos i love wasabi so i am um yeah i'm excited so let's try these strawberry chocolates so like I said, there's three different flavors. And it looks like I got two of each. No, I got three. Yeah, so I got two strawberry shortcakes, three mousses, and one brownie. I'm going to try the brownie first because I don't like... Oops. <laughs> Ichigo brownie. Ichigo brownie. I do not like chocolate. I do not like brownies. So let's get this one out of the way. It already looks weird. Look at, look at all that stuff in the bottom. What's going on there? Hmm. It's actually a lot better than I thought it was going to be. It's kind of crunchy. When I think of brownies, I think of more like, um, like a softer texture, you know? But this, this was actually a little crunchy. Are brownies, are brownies crunchy? I don't know, I don't eat a lot of brownies. But I feel like, oh, you know why it's probably crunchy? It's because on the picture, it looks like there's a bunch of nuts, nuts on there. Is that why? Huh, interesting. That was actually a lot better than I thought I was gonna I thought I was gonna hate it. So how about that? This is the Ichigo mousse. 
Ichigo mousse. So this looks like it's supposed to be like a strawberry kind of like, yeah, mousse. <laughs> looks like there's some sort of like cream, like a strawberry cream in there. Oh, the bottom is white. It's kind of melty. It's white on the bottom. Hmm. 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 That was okay. A little, a little muted. So I actually tasted more of the strawberry in the brownie. In this mousse, I actually didn't really taste a lot of the strawberry. It's kind of muted. It kind of had a very subtle flavor. Um, this is really strange to say, but I think I prefer the brownie, which I, I, I'm shocked to say that. The last one is Ichi, Ichigo Shoto Keiki. Shoto Keiki. So this is the one I saved for last because it sounds like the one that I would enjoy the most. So it looks like kind of white chocolatey, I believe. Let's try it. Mmm. Mmm. Oh yeah. Clear winner. This one was delicious. Oh yeah. The shortcake, definitely the best. It's crunchy. I have like a white chocolatey kind of strawberry flavor. The I just like the texture. Um, yeah, that was my favorite. Easily the best one. So if I had to rank them, I would do the the shortcake number one, the mousse. Oops, no, brownie number two, and the mousse number three, which was not what I was expecting. But. Those were actually a little bit better <laughs> overall than what I was expecting. And I just tried to throw the wrappers in the trash and I completely missed. So that is not my superpower. My superpower is not throwing trash into the trash. So let's try let's try this guy here. The corn potage uh, chocolate. So it looks kind of like your typical chocolate bar. Oh man, you can smell the corn potage. Holy crap. It definitely smells like corn potage. What the hell? This is insane. It's so weird. Holy crap. It's kind of like a, a um, Nestle Crunch bar. So it has kind of have like that crispy rice kind of stuff inside. But it, it I mean, this one lives up to its name. It, it definitely tastes like corn potage. <laughs> it has a very distinct corn potage taste. Um. Wow. That's so, it's so weird because it's not that it's bad. It's actually pretty good. But the, the corn potashi taste is like so overwhelming. Which is funny because I often complain about how the tastes are not strong and they're not overpowering. But this one was like, it was just like a rush of corn potage flavor. <laughs> it's pretty good. I don't know. It's weird though. I'm like, I like it, but I'm like, I don't know. Like, <laughs> I don't know if I like really like it. I, I will say this. 
I liked it that I tried it. <laughs> I'm very happy that I tried it because it's so unique. But um, it's almost like too corn potashi. It's like almost too sweet. Or not sweet. It's almost not sweet enough is what I'm trying to say. Um, but yeah, it's good though. I don't think I get it again though. So maybe it doesn't pass that test, but I would be, I wouldn't deny it to try this. I wonder if she would like it. I think she may like it because it's not overwhelm, overwhelmingly sweet. It's almost like it's, it's more corn savory potaji flavor than it is like chocolate flavor. So maybe she would like that. I'm going to send it to her, I send her a text later and ask her. So this is the main event. This is what I really want to try. Wasabi Doritos. I've never seen these before. And it says Japan Doritos, made in Japan, which makes me happy. Maybe they'll make more. Hopefully there's like more Japan exclusive Doritos in this line. I don't know what other flavors they would do, but I'm all for it. <laughs> so... Right away, it doesn't really smell like wasabi, weirdly enough. Um, yeah, let's try it. Looks like a Dorito, nothing special there. Oh my God, what? Wasabi. <laughs> mm. Mm. Mmm. 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 <laughs> you know what I'll say though? So remember when I ate those wasabi chips a while back? They came in like the weird carton. Those were like super wasabi. And like I was like crying and like I couldn't take them. These, I think these are the right balance where I'm getting that like, um, <laughs> like nose, n like sinus clearing wasabi sensation, but it's not like super strong. It's, it's, it's enough to give you that kick, but it's not too much to like make you want to cry. So in that sense, I think the wasabi seasoning is actually pretty well balanced. It's not too subtle like the wasabi Kit Kats where I wanted more kick. It, this is like almost like I'm doing the um, Goldilocks and the Three Bears <laughs> where I'm picking like the one that's just right. <laughs> I, I think this is the, the just right version. Having said that, um, for whatever reason, the, the flavor, I'm, I'm getting the wasabi, but the overall flavor is not my favorite, I will say. Like, uh, as far as Doritos go, like if I, if I were to exclude the wasabiness of it and, and then review it based purely on the comparing it to other Doritos, I don't know if this would be my favorite Dorito, though. Um, Hmm. It is good though. And if they were discounted, I probably would get these again. Actually, they are discounted right now. <laughs> but having said that, I think I would prefer, I think would prefer other Doritos over these. So, yeah. It is good though. See, there, there is that nasal. <laughs> I love that, though. That's why I love wasabi. I mean, I think my one thing is I wish they were a little, a little sweeter. Because you know how, like, Cool Ranch Doritos, they... There's like some, there's like a little bit of a sweetness to them. I feel like those wasabi chips 
are it's almost like they're 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 lacking like a little bit of sweetness to balance the the wasabi kick that would be my one nitpick um but other than that they're pretty good and i am excited to see if they make other japanese flavors because it does say japan doritos and it feels like if they're going to go out of the way to brand these as japan specific burritos <laughs> i want a japan burrito uh doritos then um it makes me wonder if they will make other flavors and if they do make other flavors i would love a okonomiyaki flavor or a takoyaki flavor if they make either of those i will be completely all over those <laughs>